The CDC is encouraging young people to get the COVID-19 vaccine despite the emergence of a potential heart condition associated with the shot. NBC 4's Jonathan Jackson is joining us now from the newsroom with more from Ohio's top health officials and what they have to say about the potential risks from the vaccine. And they aren't as concerned as you might think, right, Jonathan? That's right, Colleen. This disease, which is known as myocarditis, it is said to be an extremely rare side effect of getting the COVID shot. And on top of that, doctors say it's a condition that's often mild and treatable. We have the systems in place to identify this risk, though it is very small. Ohio's chief medical officer, Dr. Bruce Vanderhoff, says if you can get the COVID shot, then you should take it. Even though the CDC has identified a potential link between the vaccine and a heart inflammation in young people, known as myocarditis. So the signs and symptoms of myocarditis include chest pain, fatigue, shortness of breath. Dr. Vanderhoff says that most young people who experience myocarditis have very mild cases and can often recover on their own or with minimal treatment. And out of the more than 300 million doses of COVID vaccine administered in the U.S., the CDC has only encountered around 300 cases of myocarditis in people younger than 30. You're talking about a fraction of a fraction of a percent. <laughs> so we're really talking about something that happens very infrequently. And other local health officials, including cardiologists and pediatricians, agree. Even if you look at the highest risk group, which is the age group of 12 to 17 year old males, per million, the risk of myocarditis is just 70. Um, whereas the risk with COVID is much higher. If you have any questions or have any concerns, speak to your healthcare provider. And myocarditis cases were most common in males in their teens and early 20s and would mostly occur within one week of the second dose.